Given the pivotal significance of coastal areas, compounded by the impacts of climate change, hazardous events, and population pressures, intensifying the adverse effects on coastal ecosystems, there arose a pressing need for institutional support to conduct comprehensive coastal research. Responding to these challenges, the Ministry of Earth Sciences established the National Center for Coastal Research, NCCR, in 1998 as a center of excellence to meet societal demands through science-based solutions. For the past 25 years, NCCR has distinguished itself across diverse domains, encompassing coastal and marine pollution, coastal hazards, sea erosion and floods, coastal habitat and ecosystems, integrated coastal zone management, and marine spatial planning. I realize that if there is a threat to ocean, it's a threat to humanity itself. The life in ocean, the marine life, is so complicated and fragile. We have to show to the world that we are always careful about, about our environment, about our climate. The Institute has provided science-based solutions. Coastal protection strategies were developed and assisted in implementation at Pondicherry and Kerala. Shoreline management plans are being developed for Pondicherry, Tamil Nadu and Kerala. Integrated flood warning system developed for Chennai and Mumbai for providing early warning and put into operation along with State Disaster Management Department. Monitoring and prediction of marine pollution and litter through collection of data on water quality parameters covering physico-chemical, biological and microbial characteristics are systematically collected along the Indian coast, including the Lakshadweep and Andamana Nicobar Islands. Strategies for abatement of pollution are being developed for coastal states and to assist states and central government in development of policy for marine litter. Ecosystem health is being monitored at Pulikat, Chilaka, Pichavaram and Koringa for restoration and coral reef restoration efforts made at Gulf of Mannar. Acknowledging its growing responsibilities and pivotal role in national and global initiatives such as the Blue Economy, Coastal Mission and UN Sustainable Development Goals 14, the establishment of a dedicated state-of-the-art centre for coastal and marine water quality research became imperative to meet the demands of coastal states and stakeholders for preserving a healthy coastal environment. The state-of-the-art facility spread across 5.5 acres accommodates cutting-edge amenities to support NCCR's diverse research initiatives. The facilities include advanced water quality and biological laboratory equipped with top-of-the-line analytical instruments in an area of 4,000 square meters. Research building facilities include to accommodate scientists and staff in the area of 3,000 square meters. Guest house training facility and state-of-the-art conference facility. The total cost of the facility is around 78 crore rupees with laboratory building at a cost of 20 crore rupees. Today, our Honorable Minister Sri Kiren Rijiju unveils and dedicates to our nation the cutting-edge Coastal Research Laboratory CRL nestled in the serene locale of Dolphin's Nose in the presence of distinguished guests at Visakhapatnam providing a breathtaking view of the Bay of Bengal. The foundation stone for this research laboratory was laid on March 11, 2023 and its construction has been completed in record time and is being inaugurated today. On this auspicious occasion, we are performing the Bhumi Puja for the research building, marking yet another significant milestone in our journey towards advancing coastal research and development. NCCR has taken up a lead role in contributing to the coastal research not only for the marine pollution but also for shoreline management and the impact of climate change due to the coastal areas and most importantly now in contributing to the blue economy. With its dedicated team of scientists and robust institutional backing, NCCR CRL stands poised to address critical coastal challenges and contribute significantly to the nation's vision of the blue economy.